Is it too late to start wrestling? All right, the age old question that everyone asks me every day. But first, if you guys like my videos and you like all my other content, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button because it helps me out a ton. And basically what's happening is a lot of people like my content and I'm growing, but I'm growing very, very slowly. And it's because the more likes and subscriptions you get, the more YouTube promotes your content. But like, I don't have a lot right now. And like, I don't really ask for any in any of my other videos, but look, so what's happening is in the places I get promoted, I get watch time. I'm like in California or like Texas or Florida or Illinois. But like there's these states and countries where I don't get any watch time because my videos don't come up in the suggested because I'm too small of a YouTuber. So the more likes and subscriptions I get, the better chance I'll get to be able to do this full time and actually get paid to do this because right now I'm doing it completely for free. I just pour all this information out to you guys in hopes that like you guys use it and do the best you can with it. But if I could not work doing this, like that would be prime. I would start like my own wrestling gym. I'd record it every day. I'd, I'd start uh, fighting in MMA and I'd be doing that. Like I, I feel like there's a huge path for me to go down, but it's taking too long. So smash the like button, smash the subscribe button. But getting right into it, is it too late to start wrestling, okay? If you're still in school, you shouldn't even be asking me this. The best time to start learning is when you're in high school, middle school, elementary school, kindergarten, it doesn't matter. You can start wrestling as young as you want and from the age of two, okay? The only thing that changes is the availability of wrestling. The younger you are, the easier it is to get into wrestling. Being a senior is no excuse to not join the wrestling team. And what happens is all throughout school, there will be beginners at every single stage in from first grade to fifth grade there will be there will be people brand new to wrestling all right from sixth grade to eighth grade there will be people brand new to wrestling when you join all right they might be a month older two months better than you but like the best time to start is right now in high school from freshman year to your senior year there will be people there who are new to wrestling and when you're in school, it's the best time to learn because your coaches will be going over the very basic fundamentals and your like your coaches already know the best way to train you. They already know these ways that are proven to be effective to make you good at the sport. And the sooner you start, the earlier you start, the less you have to work like each time you go in order to reach the highest level when you're in high school. You know what I mean? So like if you start wrestling when you're in second grade, all the way up until high school, you don't have to put the same amount of effort to reach the same level. Like you can put in half-ass effort every, like five times a week, every single day. And when you're in high school, you will be amazing at wrestling. Now, the, uh, the later you start, the harder you have to work to reach that upper echelon. It's not saying that if you started early, you can be lazy and have poor wrestling. It's just the amount you need to improve every single day increases every day you don't wrestle. Okay, because every, like the people in your competition are getting better and you're just staying stagnant, all right? Now, this doesn't mean that you can't work to the top, okay? I started wrestling when I was a freshman in high school and I won tournaments, all right? It's very possible, very, very possible. It just determines on how hard you work, how hard you plan on working towards perfecting your ability to do this sport. And that means wrestling in the off season, wrestling in multiple tournaments in the off season, every single weekend, as much as you can, wrestling off as much as you can, doing like doing all the things you need to do. I make videos on how to become a better wrestler, but the, the more time, the quicker you start, the better you have the chance of being. Now the problem is, once you get out of high school, those beginner classes, the practices that teach you the fundamentals, single leg, double leg, high crotch, level change, snap, set up, uh, top position, bottom position, and like basic escapes, thins very, very, very heavily, okay? Like there's college wrestling and like wrestling in club for college. If you belong to a school that has a wrestling team and you join that wrestling team brand new, you are going to be eaten up and chewed up and you are going to be chewed up and spit out every single day you show up for a long time. You might not get a takedown until your junior year, right? You might not get a takedown on someone in your practice until your junior year or your senior year. You might never get a takedown on anyone because the level of competition, the level of competition you have with your training partner 
increases significantly once you get into uh, college. So if you can, don't wait. Don't wait and join right now. But if you have already waited, if you aren't affiliated with a school that has a wrestling team, and you aren't, and you're already out of high school, what's left for you is joining an MMA gym and starting wrestling there. All right, this is the weakest form of wrestling training there is, only because it's not dedicated wrestling. You don't have the same competition. There aren't competitions for you to go to. Like every time you go and compete, you get so much better. You get so, so much better. And there just, there isn't that right now for people like that have already gone out of high school. And this sucks because wrestling is one of the most, there's a clear reason why wrestlers go into MMA gyms and just eat everyone up and like spit them out. There's a reason why wrestling is so effective against jujitsu because it accomplishes something that MMA gyms fail to accomplish because they make you pay for a membership, right? It's your choice to be there. On In a high school wrestling team or in a school wrestling team, you will get kicked out if you uh, if you don't show up to practice, right? There's legit competition. There are people trying to take your spot and this cannot be replicated anywhere else. So point of this video is it's never too late to start. The best time to start is right now. And the sooner you start, the younger you are when you start, the better position you're put in to reach the top level of wrestling. All right, this will help you in every aspect of your life. If you're on the verge, if you're questioning whether or not you should wrestle, just try it because wrestling is something that helps you in every aspect of your life. It helps you in other sports. It helps you in your work ethic. It helps you in your confidence. It helps you in uh, your ability to make decisions. It helps you in your ability to make shit happen, to see the like actual cause and effect of like, what you do and your actions. And like this is something that you can't get outside like you can't get the same training when you're in school, when you're in high school and middle school and elementary school, than you can when like after that stage. Cause if you try to join college wrestling, you're gonna be put with people of a much higher caliber than anyone would have been in like your high school team, you know what I mean? So the learning curve is gonna be a lot steeper and it's gonna be a lot harder for you to pick up, like, right? Cause you're gonna be wrestling with people who are super competitive, not trying to teach you, they're trying to improve themselves. It's just gonna be a lot more difficult. So do it while you're younger, if you can. So point of this video is it's never too late to start. The best time to start is right now. And the sooner you start, the younger you are when you start, the better position you're put in to reach the top level of wrestling. All right, and remember, this will help you in every aspect of your life. If you're on the verge, if you're questioning whether or not you should wrestle, just try it because unlike any other sport, it gives you, I don't even know how to explain it. It's just super addicting and, but if you guys like that video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I try to post new content every day at eight, but until next time, I'll see you guys, peace.